Randomness is a strange concept that defies intuition. Seemingly random actions, such as a series of coin flips, can produce long sequences of heads or tails that perceptually lack randomness, while a clearly patterned series of numbers, such as a digit series of normal numbers, would pass many tests of randomness. Conceptually, randomness can be theoretically assumed, but in practice, it can only truly be inferred indirectly from properties of a generated output through various statistical tests that attempt to quantify it. Randomness is an unobservable property of a generating process. Beyond the theoretical, the applications of randomness spans a broad range of fields. In its more classic manifestations, it can be found in art, music, and literature, as well as gaming and gambling. It also plays a critical role in the statistics of science. But within the past few decades, it has by far seen its largest practical application in securing modern communications. All major ancient civilizations engaged in games of chance, initially using dice. Evidence of such games existed as far back as 2100 BC among ancient Egypt, India, and China. The Chinese in particular had a long history of playing games of chance before Europeans. Around 1150 BC, the Chinese text I Ching, or Book of Changes, discussed problems related to coin tossing, exploring permutations of heads and tails. In ancient Greece, Democritus considered randomness a subjective concept arising from human inability to understand events, while Aristotle viewed chance as a genuine but minor part of the world, making the first attempts to classify randomness into events that are certain, probable, and unknowable. Epicurus further proposed the idea of inherent randomness that is woven into an atomic fabric that forms existence. By the Roman Empire, chance was personified as the goddess Fortuna, and games of chance were used to simulate her decisions. However, by the age of Christianity, the deterministic nature of Christian teachings posed challenges, with scholars like Augustine, Aquinas and Martin Luther grappling with the concept of free will versus divine foreknowledge. Throughout history, chance has always been linked with faith and divination. Despite encountering chance for millennia, the understanding of randomness progressed slowly as grasping statistical principles from everyday experiences proved too challenging. 